Bess. How you doing? Great. I just took a nice, luxurious bubble bath, and I'm ready to boogie. When are you coming back here? That's still kind of hard to say, but listen. Remember that old photo of a boy and his dog you said you saw in that box of stuff Henry sold to Lamont? Yeah. Did it look like it was maybe taken in the 1920s? That's exactly what it looked like. Why? Because I need to find out the name of Bruno Bollet's dog. And if that boy was Bruno, then that was probably his dog. Was there any writing on the picture? Yeah, as a matter of fact, I think it said Bruno. That's all it said? Just Bruno? No, it, it said Bruno and, but whatever came after and was hidden by the frame. I really need to know the name of that dog. Oh, no. No, you don't. No more snooping. Uh-uh. Best, just get into that box again and see if the dog's name is on that picture. That's all I want you to do. How? I can't just go waltzing into Lamont's back room. And he's for sure as heck not going to fall for that sneeze contraption again. There must be some other way you can distract him. Please, Bess, I can't tell you how important this is. You've got to do this for me. Please? Okay. We're not going to have any fun here until you solve this mystery, and since you can't do that until I do this... Okay, I'll sneak into the back room and take another look at that photo. I mean, I will if I don't screw up. Think positive, Bess. You're going to do fine. You bet I am. In fact, I'm not going to call you again until I have seen that picture. I'm going in. You go, girl. Hey! That gumbo stand outside? What do you think? Is it pretty authentic? Outstanding! Just watch the hot sauce. Whatever's in it gives my stomach instant fits. You know, I still feel guilty about that sneezing thing, so how about I go and get you a nice big bowl of gumbo? What Just so happens I'm starving, so hey, you got a deal. Great. I'll be right back. Hey, what'll it be? Can I get a gumbo to go, please? Eat up! That my gumbo? There you go. Enjoy! Mm-mm. Uh-oh. Oh, you're gonna have to excuse me. Uh-oh. I better get out of here. Grant? The dog's name was Grant? That's what it said on the photo. Kind of a weird name for a dog, huh? Yeah, well, Bruno Bollet was kind of a weird guy. Hey, thanks a lot, Bess. You've been a huge help. I'll tell you, being sneaky takes a lot out of me. I'm exhausted. I still don't know when I'll get back there, so just kind of hang loose, okay? Story of my life. Call me if you need me. I will. Bye.
That should keep you guys quiet for a while. Iggy, come here, Iggy. Got something for ya. Hi, Bess. Listen, you busy? Uh, why? I need you to do something for me. What? I need you to infiltrate the meeting of the Jolly Rogers crew that's about to be held at Rampart and Dumaine, which has got to be right near Zeke's. You're gonna have to look around for it. Now, to get into the meeting, you'll need to put on that Skeleton Man costume you saw in the back room. And once you're in the meeting, you'll need to listen for the name that opens the meeting so you can tell me what it is, okay? No. Beth, I know you don't like to do stuff like this, but this is really, really, really important. And it'll be the last thing I ask you to do. I promise. Oh, all right. I don't suppose it would do any good to point out that the curio shop is closed? You'll find a way in. Oh, and if anyone at the meeting asks, the password is Scuttled Bones. Okay, I'll give it a shot. That's the spirit. <laughs> 